Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Nave the Stylist. Here I'm showing you guys how to install a glue disclosure wig that I've already hand stitched and applied slide combs to for an instant install. My most important tip is to style and completely prep the wig before you put it on your clients or your head. Before installing or doing anything to anyone's hair, always make sure that it's well cleaned, deep conditioned, oiled, and ready to go. You want to make sure that your braid pattern is very flat. I like this braid pattern because it's easy for my clients to slide the slide combs up under their braid with no tension. Okay y'all, so the wig is prepped, knots are bleached, edges are laid and we're just going to place this on our client's head make sure it's centered prior to installing the wig you want to make sure that you have your client's exact measurements so that the wig fits perfectly if it's too small it'll slide back if it's too big it'll be too far forward you want to make sure that lace is sitting exactly at their hairline for a most natural look here I am just sliding the combs in and making sure that it's not pulling her hair or anything. And of course, make sure it's centered. Ask your client how the fit is. If it's snugly like a stocking cap, it's perfect. If it's too tight or too loose, then the measurements are off. Now, I am using Gas to Be Yellow Can Free Spray and the gel that's in the black um, bottle to lay her edges. Because I prepped the wig beforehand and molded my edges beforehand, it made this so much easier and quicker. So here, to make the lace more undetectable, I'm going in between the lines of the baby hairs with some LA Girl Pro Concealer. I don't remember the color, but I'll have, the, have that in the description for you. Use this product very lightly, and if you do get any on the hair, just use alcohol to get it off. Seal your makeup with some freeze spray when you're done. When you're done, you want to comb all your hair neatly back in place and shape it to your client's head. Now, I'm just going with some Sebastian Sharper Plus hairspray to get rid of the flyaways and just straighten it out, blending it, touching up, doing the last you know final touches so i just want to show you guys a comparison between my client's head and the actual wig being on her head baby this is like an instant sew-in super flat comfortable not tight to her head just perfect